Carpenter. What's up, fam? Good morning. It's supposed to rain today. Did you know that? You probably do now, and that is exciting here because in California, that's rare. We don't ever get rain. So we'll see if it actually happens. It's actually supposed to thunderstorm, which is even more rare, especially where we live, which is in the California Valley, and I love rain. I live in the wrong state for loving rain, but I love rain. It's like my favoriteest thing ever. It's so calming to me. I just, I, I love it. I dressed all the kids in rain boots this morning and sent them with umbrellas. I'm probably being a little over dramatic because the rain here is like half a sprinkle compared to other people. Addie is prepared for today. Let me see. Oh, no, I don't want it. You can have it. That's okay. You can have it. I don't want it. No, thank you. So anyway, fingers crossed. We'll see if that actually happens. Hard to be sexy. <laughs> 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 you totally killed that moment. <laughs> Gotta love Invisalign. Ooh. I actually do. Oh, it's raining! Ah! <gasps> Did you know what rain is? We'll finish that Put thought. Hang on. Put the kitty down. Go hold it. Look at her. She's like, so? <gasps> what is that? Do you feel the water? You hear it? She doesn't know what to think. What is that? Bring her out more so she can. Come here. We're such Californians and we have our freaking baby outside of the diaper because we're freaking out about the rain. <gasps> Look at that. We'll get her dressed in a second, guys. I promise. She doesn't, she's not interested anyway. Anyway, while we watch the rain, there's other little babies coming outside. <laughs> Look at her, she's like, oh, the rain. See, Addy, you've got to stand in it. Yeah, that one's a little bit older, so she, I think, gets it probably. Anyway, what I was saying is, I have Invisalign, which I really do like. Compared to braces, I would do it 100% all over again, minus the fact of like, you know, losing it once in a while. But sometimes when you wear like makeup and lipstick and stuff, it gets like stuck on it right here. So I was like, hey, ooh la la. And then he's like, you have lipstick on your teeth. <laughs> I guess that can happen anyway, but it's like more likely with this. Playing Gabe and Checkers. I've beat him 13 times in a row. <laughs> You play, you're playing checkers? My baby daddy is playing checkers with my other baby daddy. <laughs> Gentlemen, I wash my hands of this weirdness. I just beat him in battleship too. Mama, you beat him in battle. Mama. Can I help you? Yes, oh now we're excited about the rain. Yes, I see. Look, it tells you how many times I've won, 12. You won checkers 12 times? How many times has he won though? I don't think he's ever won. <laughs> Why does he keep playing with you? <laughs> I know it should tell you how many times you've lost too, huh? It should have think. like a little red It doesn't X. want to get you discouraged. I guess. Do you like this color though? I do like that color. Mm, sneak peek. We'll talk more about that another time. To be continued, stay tuned. The kids get out of school in like 10 minutes. A little bit less than 10 minutes. It didn't rain all day and of course they have to like walk from their classroom all the way to like where I picked them up at. I sent them with umbrellas, sort of. I sent Lilia and I tried to send the twins with one too and they were like, <laughs> And I was like, you're probably right. And then here it is, raining. It's supposed to thunderstorm. Hey, come here. <sighs> Terrible twos in full effect. Get your butt over here right now. Oh. <gasps> hey, you listen to mommy. Don't tell me no. Come here. One. Two. Three. Is mommy laughing? No. Correct. No. 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 Okay. You still have to get dressed. You're losing. <laughs> it's a face of victory. This is how we do it in Cali. Either shorts or a snow outfit. Because we're either dramatic AF or we're being real with ourselves. Because it's really not cold. <laughs> I was like, oh, I might need keys, huh? I couldn't pass up the opportunity though because it's probably not gonna rain for another like two years. Look at how cute you look. See what I mean? We've got Kyson being like me and kind of a little bit dramatic with the sweater. Then we've got the realistic Caden here. He's like, bro, it's not even cold. <laughs> I'm gonna take my jacket off. Then we've got Lilia who wants so bad for it to be raining and it's just, it's just not no, anymore. No. Yes. It was pouring out here. It was ah! pouring. <laughs> stuck outside really? and then it was raining and then everybody was acting savage. Savage? Everyone was acting savage? Everybody in California gets crazy, huh? Whenever it starts raining? Yeah. Okay, in the back, in the back. Today I had a little bit of a rough day. Why? I love how everybody just like piles in, like through the front door. I have a back door, you know. Continue, I wanna hear your story. So, Addie 
We did it start. Who was that? Dramatic of a day, huh? Yeah. Oh, um, it wasn't really dramatic, but like, I've been searching around for stuff. They were very small, so we thought it would be, so we thought it would be like Tinkerbell, so we kept on looking for clues, and we found her flower. You found Tinkerbell's flower at your school? In Modesto, California. Seriously? We should sell it on eBay. <laughs> no? No. So then we found like a little like house that was, that was with small things. Really? What is going on? <laughs> and it had a key on the wall. Did you take it? No, no, no I didn't take it. I took a man, baby. Huh? I took a oh, man, baby. You took a man? <laughs> Actually, I think I did take it. Oh, oh, suddenly we have it. Okay, all right, okay. Oh. And really? then, oh, that's a bead. That's a bead. And it is a bead. Is, and this is what I also found. <gasps> really? What? <gasps> that's a bead too. Oh, Kaden's invested. What is it? That's a bead. Oh, everybody's up now. Okay. Hug. Everybody's yeah. up now. So every time I pick up the kids in school, we pretty much just like sit in our parking spot for like 20 minutes and talk about school before we actually go home. I'm being a little dramatic, but I want to hear all their stories. I'm so excited to hear about all your school stories immediately, right now, not when we get home. Uh, what is going on? Hang on, so pause, she pause. Me. I can't Are you help. upside down? I can't hear. I don't even know what is going on right here. When your car is so big, it's actually like a house. Daddy, say sorry. Oh, <laughs> I don't know what happened, but it looks like they figured it out. There are nine dogs at the park. Five of them have balls. The rest are eating bones. How many dogs are eating bones? Four. Good job. Kaden, sir, what are you doing with your time? Nothing. <laughs> Clearly. <laughs> oh, goodness. Do you want to learn how to ride that? No, but I want to put me on it. Do you want mommy to help you? Yeah, and then I'm gonna do it by myself. Okay, and wants to ride. Let's see if we can teach a five-year-old how to ride a hoverboard. I don't even know how to ride this thing, so I don't know how much of a help I'll be, but I will try. Okay, let go, let go, let go, <laughs> You gotta <laughs> How do we get off of it? I haven't ridden this thing since Christmas. And then jump off. Just jump off? Yeah, jump oh. off of the grass. Jump. <laughs> okay, that thing scares me. I don't want a part of it. It looks like the storm is finally coming. I'm hoping, is that weird? Oh, God. I feel like not very many people are like begging for a storm to come, but it's just like we never get it. Whenever we do get it, I'm just like longing for it. Chris went to go do all of the errands with the kids today. Not errands, that's not the right word. Um, activities with the kids today. They have danced all day long, so I stayed back and I'm cleaning the house and I am working on my video as usual. I feel like I'm always working on my video. Oh, speaking of, I think the first batch just got back. How was hip hop, boys? Oh my god, you guys, look at that. I'm so excited. This is not a sight that is commonly seen here. You guys probably think I'm absolutely ridiculous for continuing to say this. Thank you. Is that thunder? <gasps> thunder? Do you know what thunder is? Uh, uh, Do you know what thunder is? Yeah. What is it? Lightning? Do you know what lightning is? It's in the sky. She looks up. <laughs> it's crazy how much she actually knows. Babies of this age don't talk a whole lot, but man, Ma they Ma understand. Ma yes, <gasps> it's coming. Lily is at dance and the boys just left to go get their hair cut. <laughs> I'm supposed to be editing my video, but this stinky pie won't Ma let me do anything. Mommy, mm -hmm. <gasps> Did you see the lightning? I just saw the lightning. Let's see if we see it, let's see if we see it. Can't tell if there's thunder or if it's all of our neighbors putting out our trash cans because tomorrow's trash day. The struggle. <gasps> that was definitely thunder.
That was not a sound effect. <laughs> She probably never, ever remembers ever seeing a thunderstorm or being in a thunderstorm. This isn't dangerous, right? Bike. Oh, are all of, ooh, good, good call, Addie. Let me make sure all of our toys are put away. Ooh, I have a pile of clothes sitting on the front porch. <laughs> You do not want to be out here for this, Sadie. No, you don't. Kitties are safe and indoors. I have an update coming on this one. Don't worry. Here comes the first official rain of the season. Are you ready? It ain't the way I want it. Got to follow through. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. It ain't the way I want it. Got to follow through. I was watching you. Did you look good, bud? You were doing so good. Soon after. Time for our every night wrestling match routine. Final round. Too much, Kate Kaisen. <laughs> For the record, this is mutually agreed upon fight. Wrestling, I should say. Um, I used to tr like tell them to stop, and after having like three boys, I think after three, two of them being the same age, I kind of just stopped and let them go at it and just set boundaries. I actually learned in child development that physical, oh, there's, a, there's a word for it, oh, it's been a minute. It'll come to me. It's literally like a part of learning and like development, especially for boys, but it actually helps them establish their own boundaries with themselves and it's, it's beneficial for their development. I'm not saying to let your kid go and like beat the crap out of somebody, but when it comes to having a bunch of boys, they're very physical beings and it's good to let them ex explore their boundaries and know uh, what is what is and is not okay. But I literally learned that in college and ever since then, I like saw a different way. I don't even wanna just stereotype it to just like boys because I know it's like way beyond just boys. But in my experience and I think most people's experience, although I do know several boys who are not physical like that, but I think this is like a genetic thing. Anyway, what I'm saying is no, 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 no. No, don't mess with the import. My ugh, computer is importing, and if you like look at it or breathe at it, it stops. I hate it. Wait, what? I know it's so frustrating. Okay, no, don't literally breathe on it. <laughs> anyway, wrestling match is over, so, and we're gonna head off to bed. Chris has been dressing her in oversized shirts to go to bed. It's so cute and so comfy. Thank you, baby. She's so excited to go to bed. She did not nap today. I tried so many times, she did not nap, so she's super excited and ready to go to bed. And I'm ready for her to go to bed. And I'm ready for bed. So, I'm gonna wrap this up here, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching, and we'll talk to you guys in our next video. Good night!